This song is my favourite of all the soundtrack. Welcome back to V V V V V. Uh, too many V's. Uh, with this awesome music, let's get started. Uh, so we have one more um, crew member to find, and I don't know if you remember last time when we were exploring that yellow area, uh, we did come across coordinates for that green area up top, so that's probably where our last crew member is. But this episode, I want to kind of explore a little bit and collect some of the trinkets that we haven't found yet. So we're going to go back to uh, this teleporter here, I do believe. Yep, there we go. So this is where we saved, uh, what's his name? Vitellary last time. And I don't know if you remember, but I actually forgot a trinket here. Uh, can I get through? I don't think I can. Um, I might have just screwed myself over. Um, is there another teleporter that I can use? Um, looks like that's the nearest one. And of course it takes me out there. Um, uh, hmm. The next best teleporter's there. Gonna have to go with it. Uh, Vermilion isn't here now. That we've uh, saved. Thingy. I guess I could show off the other way because I never did. Here, lies, and actually, this way is a trinket that I completely forgot about. Wow, I'm good at games. Yeah, and great. Now, why do I do? Why do I do that? Now I have to go through lies again. Goddamn lies! Wah! Oh, come on! Right, let's just do this again. I see if I can do that again. There we go, just need a little bit of time. And patience. So, I'm gonna try and make my way back over to this place. Okay, I got the checkpoint at least. Right, come on, if you fall up, just pick yourself down. back. Look down here. The warning. I love this place. Oh, great. I don't like this bit. Oh. Yeah. First bit's easy. The second bit is... is you're conveying a new idea. Dang it. Come on. I've been surprised at how fast this game is going. Like, th this is we're on pop. Four, I think? Yeah, we're on part four already. And we only have one crew member left to save. So we are going through this game very quickly. Quicker than I actually imagined. Uh, which is kind of worrying, but in the same time, um it's been fun. Um, playing this. Uh it's a hard game. Once you've pretty much played it once, you know how everything works. Oh god. <laughs> uh, once you played it once, and you know how everything works, it's pretty easy the second time round. Like, I haven't been dying as much as I did in the, my last playthrough of this, and finally we got up to the thing. Easiest room in the game there. <laughs> um, I haven't been dying as much as um, I did when I played this game first, I think. The total death count on my save file when I first played it, it was 1,000 and something. What are we up to now? 187, yeah. Uh, so, considering that my death count was 1,000, pretty much, um, shows how how much I've gotten better at this game. Um, how did you get this? You don't do that. So if you... Exit the room. Hmm. Oh, I think I see. Do you have to get pushed through? This is one of the trinkets I didn't collect when I uh, first played the game, so I didn't don't know. I didn't even get that. What? 
Hmm. So there's no way to do it because there's spikes there, but if you leave the room... Unless you're not meant to die, that might be it. I think I'm just gonna leave that trinket. That old trinket will always tantalize us. Unfortunately. Let's teleport back to the ship. And here we are. Let's actually get on with some progress. Uh, because well, we did kinda get some progress. We got a trinket, did we? I don't know if we got a trinket or not. Uh wow, I'm an idiot. Uh let's go over here on the underside of the ship. Because we haven't been there yet. And there's some pretty interesting stuff. Have we been here? Right. Yeah, we have been here. Okay. Uh, well, in that case, let's go... Actually, no, we haven't explored... Um... This little bit. Yeah, we haven't gone all the way... Across... Let's do that. So here's that teleporter there. Uh, up here is the um, place where we went to last time. Um, and we got stuck in an admission. Grumble, grumble. Uh, no, why am I saying grumble, grumble? That one was my favourite one. Um, now there is a secret around here somewhere. There's a terminal there. Oh yeah, out of hole. Okay. So we've already been there. Whoops. Um, so let's go on the underside of the hole. Aha, here it is. So if we slip through this little gap here. We keep going along. Get ready to feast your eyes on this. It's a giant elephant. No idea why there is a giant elephant here, but if you go further on, there is one of them shiny to link it to 11 out of 20. Yeah, uh, <laughs> I don't know why there's an elephant. For some reason, if you go down here. Oh, is it? Where is it? Oh, for some reason, it's not showing up, but it's very like. Oh, there we go. Yeah, he like frowns. I don't know why. Uh, now he's sad. Oh. But let's leave that area. And now we are permanently sad, apparently, after seeing that elephant. Hey, we're happy again. So yeah, a random elephant in the middle of nowhere. No idea where. But hey. <laughs> Why not? Elephants are awesome. Uh, let's go... Back over here. This has been more of an exploration episode, and if you don't like that, then I'm sorry. But exploration is like half of the game. You have to explore to find all your team members. There is a terminal here. Let's read it. I have to seal access to most of our research. Who knows what could happen if it fell into the wrong hands? Got a little bit of foreshadowing there. Um, got a little blue section, uh, which we probably won't see at all. Um. I don't want to spoil what it is, uh, but let's just say that you need to 100% everything to go there. Um, now obviously this is not 100% playthrough, so I won't be doing that. Whereabouts are we? Okay, let's go to that teleporter up here. I uh, also like how there's like arrows, if you go over here, like, yeah, it's pointing to different places. Uh, there's nothing up there, so let's hop into... Hop into the teleporter. Jeez. And let's teleport here. And we haven't actually explored to the right of the ship, so why not do that? And I think we'll end the episode off uh, soon as well, after we explored some little bits of the ship. To the right. To the right, to the right. 
And we're not going to go down this time to the tower, we're going to go up. Even though the map kind of loops. We've got a teleport here. Uh, our first breakthrough is the creation of the inversion plane, which creates a mirror dimension beyond a given event horizon. Oh, I've already found this. And there's a teleport here, if you so wish. To use it. Let's keep exploring the depths of space and speaking of depths of space. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to explore a lot of places at once. That's why I'm like sneaking in and out of uh, different places. Uh, we've got a little thing here. What's down here actually? Uh, nothing. That was completely useless and a waste of time. Uh, so let's go back up. Keep going up. And as you can see, we're at the top of our ship, and our ship is kind of broken. Uh, as you can tell. Uh, let's go up here. Pick one. Yay! What's up, all there? Let's go up here. Oh god, yep, yeah, that was a bad idea. Uh, this leads back here, so we've pretty much come full circle, really. Uh, so let's go back to the ship and end the episode off. This, I know it's been kind of a short one, but we've done pretty much explored most of the map. And I don't know why, but I flipped it around. Is there a teleporter down there? There isn't. Let's explore most more of the map, because we haven't actually hit like 15 minutes yet. Um, and why not? It couldn't help us to explore more of the map. Uh, so we've got some stuff over here. Uh, again, not really useful because it's walls. Those walls, god dang them walls. Uh, let's explore over here. There's something over here. Aha! It's Violet Vermilion! That way he looks a little dangerous. We are danger freaks, so we are going to do it. And does this lead? Okay, I think it leads where I think it's leading. Yeah, okay. So, in the next episode, we'll see where this takes us. Mysterious objects. 